Aaron, when you see that type of performance out of James Paxton, how encouraged does that leave you moving forward? Well, that's, that's the type of pitcher we know he's capable of being. You know, that right there, you know, a dominant, you know, lefty that can command all his pitches. You know, I was looking up there, looking at Guardy. I think it might have been the first or second inning. He was hitting 99 miles an hour, which was, you know, we've seen it from him before, but it was good to see him, you know, especially tonight. Um, big game like this, and um, he came out to play today. It was awesome. What can you guys do to keep this momentum going now? Just feed off the energy tonight. You know, we were, you know, ready to go from the first inning. Um, you know, we got quality at bats from, you know, all the way up and down our lineup. You know, it was huge. You know, DJ coming up with that base hit, you know, the right field like he's been doing all year. And then Luke comes up with the same thing, you know, base hit the center, get those two early runs. That was huge, you know, especially against, you know, an ace like Chris Sale. You got to try to get him early because if he gets in a groove, he's, he's pretty much unhittable. So it was just, you know, some timely hitting by, you know, some key guys for us. You mentioned Sale. Did he look different than he did a season ago? Uh, it's tough to say, you know, he's still able to get the fastball to 96, I think, a couple of times. And, you know, he was able to work that slider and change up, you know, when he wanted to, you know, kind of keep us off balance. Uh, but we were just able to, you know, in tight situations, just, you know, pull out a knock here and there on him. What's it like to be part of that lineup tonight where everybody one through nine gets a hit and contributes? What's that kind of night like? For well, it just comes down to our approach, you know, if, you know, us just sticking to our pregame approach on what we're going to do against Sale and that and their bullpen. And uh, we, we executed our plan. You know, that's the biggest thing. When you got, you know, all nine guys, you know, focus on the same plan, focus on the same approach, and go out and execute it. It's a pretty, pretty tough lineup. So, um, you know, we just went out there and just did our job. It's just one game, but did this victory feel bigger with all the injuries that you have? Every, everyone is big, you know, especially right now. But um, I, like I said before, you just got to give hats off to Paxton. You know, we fed off his energy early. And he, he just he set the table for us. We went out there and, you know, see him go. That for our first inning, you know, just showing what he had, I was like, okay, we got to, it's going to be a ball game tonight. Aaron didn't make a difference, but it was the fifth inning. You were on third, Torres hit a ball to Martinez in left field. Did you think you were going to be sent there, or what did Nevin tell you in that situation? Yeah, I was going to go, uh, but just based on him coming in, you know, J.D. coming in and, you know, kind of taking his momentum forward, you know, I just didn't think it would be, you know, especially with Clint Frazier on deck and, you know, already hit a homer, I think his previous at bat, you know, I was, you know, keeping my faith in him, so it's, um, it was just a tough read on that one, especially the ball coming in, but, uh, you know, maybe I might test it next time. We'll see.